I'm Dr. Lori, the PhD Antiques Appraiser from Television, and I'd like to talk to you today about crystal. A lot of people don't know the difference of crystal, don't understand why crystal is different from glass, and we're going to talk about some of the things. Right off the bat, crystal is 24% or more lead content. That's what makes it crystal. That's first. So there's a definition for crystal. If you're looking at crystal, you're probably looking at some of the most popular names in crystal, like Waterford, or maybe you're looking at Swavorsky, or maybe you're looking at Lalique, right, crystal. Now, each of these pieces have a couple of things that I want you to remember. When you're looking for valuable crystal, here's what you should be looking for. First of all, clarity, very, very clear crystal will be. Crystal will catch the light, and crystal will also, in fact, have a particular color. There's usually kind of a silvery haze or a silvery tone to crystal. Very, very clear. It has a particular catching the light element and also sort of this silvery color. Crystal is easy to cut because of the lead additive. And because it's easy to cut, that's how it catches the light and it sparkles so well. If you have a piece that you think might be crystal, but you're really not sure, you can send it to me for an appraisal, a photograph of it. Don't send anybody your actual object. Send me a photograph of your piece of crystal, or what you think might be crystal, and I can appraise it for you, or you can bring it to one of my events. <laughs>